Good evening, Mr. Elmore. Good evening, Council. Happy to be here with y'all once again. And thank y'all for helping us with the 24 and also the, the um, 31 so the workers could get to work. Now, I'm here once again. We still having problems down there at sanitation. The pay, they fixed it, but then again, we still having problems. Then we also, I right, now we also need the equipment. They want the job done, but then again, we don't have the proper equipment and also the proper gear to, to do the job. But we, we trying to do it the best as possible. And another thing now, when are the trucks going to be here, the new trucks? Because we have, they told us that they, that they were supposed to be here in September. Now it's October. Then Raj came on there and told us they will not be here until February. So we still going to be having to, to work through all this extreme weather with less trucks and also less manpower. So that's going to be harder on us. And now the trucks that we do got, they starting to break down. So it's going to be, it's going to be kind of rough for us. So the only thing I'm asking is, can y'all please help us? Now also, we have a safety issue down there. I'm not gonna really elaborate on that right now, but I'm gonna have people behind me come and talk about that. We have a real safety issue down there. Y'all really have to look into that, really. And we need uniforms. It's about to be winter time, and we still wear our uniforms from two years ago. We need our uniforms. Because now they trying to say, if we don't be coming now, if we don't have the proper uniform on, they gonna send us home. Now that's another short of manpower. Now the good guys that do work, that's gonna be harder on us. So we just asked y'all, can y'all please provide us with the uniform that we, that they would post to give us. Yes. Um. Oh, and silver. Um, we have the bulk day up on the first Wednesday. Could you could you see if the cars don't be double double part so we could grab the bulk out and not and not scrape pe people cars because when we come down there up up on the third Wednesday, well the second no the first Wednesday, the first Wednesday the cars be double parked and it'd be hard for us to grab the mattresses. And, and um, the wood over the cars. Then if we scrape the cars, the residents come out, oh, you scraped my car? And that's caused more conflict. And knowing, and knowing our, our supervisors, we might get suspended. So we just trying to work together so we could, so we could be a team at this. And instead of us going back and forth, cause we get nothing out of that. And that's about it. Y'all have a great weekend and enjoy your day. Thank you. Good evening, Council. Um, my name is Mikhail McElroy. I am a laborer of the Division of Public Buildings and Public Works. I am also the shop steward of Local 617. I'm here to stand behind my laborers who performs an outstanding job throughout this city on a daily day base. Um, my first issue is that half of our per diem employees down in the DPW has not received a 2021 retro check for their hard work and service. And my second issue today is that the director and the manager of public building does not respond to emails when myself as a union rep asks for something or meetings to discuss the conditions of public building vehicles and equipment to perform work duties properly. And Councilwoman MacGyver, president, let me correct that. Ms. Roundtree, you, you ladies, y'all have witnessed when we do flag raisings and we stand the flags up outside, we don't have the proper stuff to hold these flags up when the wind blows, such as sandbags. 
so you know that that is my main concern you know so we could keep pushing and moving this forward city thank you you martha rodriguez union rep for local 617 representing city employees um i'm not gonna spend five minutes talking because it's not worth it um for the safety of the guys at the garage and anywhere else in the city of newark a memorandum doesn't fix safety for incidents um accidents that happens at the garage a memorandum doesn't fix the problem training fix problems and i'm done